What's up everyone, my name is Matt Campagna and I'm the founder and CEO of Reflection. In today's video, I'll be showing you firsthand how to get set up with Reflection Go. We'll cover creating your account, telling Virtual Coach about your sport so it can personalize training for you, more on that later, and then how to use our app in order to track your data over time. Let's dive in. So now from any browser, I'll do this from my iPhone, but you can use a, a computer if you want, head to go.reflection.us. Click sign up and enter your personal information. So I'll just do that quick and be right back. Once you put in your billing address, if you have a referral code or a discount from us, you can enter that here and then enter your credit card information and hit subscribe. Great, and now that I'm subscribed, I'll head over to my email in order to verify my account. Hit verify now, that will take you back to the login page where I'll log back in. Here's where we'll personalize our account. And this is a really important step because Reflections Virtual Coach tailors the training for you. So you'll give it your sport, position, level, and how often you train. And we'll use that information in order to tailor the cognitive skills um, that are most important for you as an athlete, specifically into your training plans. Make sure to answer this honestly. And when you put in how many times per week you train, just put in the, the amount of times that you train per week for your sport. Here, I'm actually going to jump ahead. In the next video, we'll cover setting up your Quest and getting the Reflection Go app installed. Um, but for now, let me show you around. So we'll set up notifications. This is important because we'll give you reminders to help keep you on track with your training. All right, and now that we have the Reflection Go app installed on our home screen, I'll open that here. And one more time, I'll be logging back in. Click Enable Notifications. Allow, finish setup, and we're good to go. And there's a notification. So these are important because again, they'll they'll help give you reminders if you're if you're uh, ready for a for a session that you haven't done yet. Um, and from time to time, we'll give you useful pieces of information, tips, and tricks there as well. So here you can see your performance rankings. For me, I don't have any yet. We'll get to that once we get into into the app. Um, and then pretty simple navigation here, so you can adjust your profile. I can see uh, my account information there. We can then go to billing and adjust our, our account. So if we wanted to upgrade, cancel sub subscription, update billing information, you can do this all from here as well. If you ever want to update your personalization, so let's say you're entering a different season in a different sport and you wanted to tailor it now for soccer instead of basketball, you can do that by clicking personalize and going through the setup again. Refer and earn, so once you're a happy Reflection customer and you've been using Go for a few months, you can actually refer people to use Reflection Go using your unique code right here. So you click generate referral link and whenever you give this link to somebody, it will give you one month free and give them their first month for 99 cents. So it's a really great way to spread the word. And lastly, you can always manage notification settings um, from here where it says notifications. You'll need a meta quest in order to use Reflection Go. You can use a Quest 2, Quest 3, or Quest Pro, and we'll put links down in the description below so that you can go find those. Once you have your quest, head over to part two where Emily will show you how to unbox it and how to install the Reflection Go VR app. If you have any questions, feel free to reach out and we'd be happy to help. 